Hi guys, I hope you're good. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Mbuisa Lovelaz and thank you so much for taking your precious time to join me. I'm so glad to be outside. Um, the sun is out. It has been so rainy in the Western Cape province um, this week. So I'm blessed that the sun is out. But I'm not here for that. I'm here to talk about um, the Bala family. Okay? It's not everything that I want to discuss. It's just two things or three things, you know. First of all, uh, you would have noted that we didn't see Jen in this episode, all right? And um, according to Loiso, Jen is in Johannesburg, all right? And Loiso sees this as a great opportunity for his mother to connect with the kids. So then, uh, Batati and Gane, they go to play some games. And I'm like, is it a coincidence that U Jen is not present and Loiso uses that opportunity you know for umama kuta umama wake uta connect you know with the kids and i'm like hmm is jen a stumbling block i don't know for me i really blame uloiso guys and all of this you can see that he is willing um uguti umawake and the kids you know to connect but i'm not sure whether he's scared of jen or what but maybe i think he's just a different person whenever when he's with jen all right and so he then speaks about that's why i'm also okay listen to why i'm also saying i blame loiso his mother's like you know what we also want to jen to show up whenever we're doing certain things and he's like oh no that's actually my fault because i sit with invitations and i do not tell it because there's just a lot for me now we can really see who the big problem is and he even said something he was like yeah but i'm sure you all heard him he was like but guys um you know jen not seeing i mean uh, my mom not seeing the kids has been really justified and i'm like what are you saying my guy what are you saying so i think sometimes we blame oma koti but i feel like the big problem is the mkwenyana all right is loiso loiso probably he never really was not big even at visiting his family probably maybe even before his marriage we, you may never know okay but we are not there um yeah there was also uh, a very interesting scene of us is pinky they're doing um, Twain doing a slung. speed dating i candidate someone has eight kids baba please focus on your kids aye, 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 you have a speed date aye, aye, aye. so the second candidate was like um oh there was this one who was like oh my god you're so beautiful oh you're so beautiful i bo baba Okay, the other one was like, you know what, I want to have kids, you know. I'm not sure if that's what Sis Pinky wants at, at her age, you know. And I, the fourth candidate, was like, you know, if I want something, I, you know, when I want something, I become hardcore. And is the one, no, Betty, um, I don't want a relationship, I want a partnership. A red flag. But eventually, Sis Pinky was like, you know what, I'm not choosing anyone i am not you know the right time is coming but it was very interesting to see um I, I think dating is so hard at that age honestly i think at our age is so easy um we don't also have so many ties like you find that at that age people have kids some some of them have grandchildren you know and it's so hard to find a right partner at that time there are so many factors that you have to take into account Don Munyumundu has been probably divorced even three years you know four times so uh, it's not easy for dating around that age okay another thing that i wanted us to discuss lastly is the audition so they are hosting they want to have a bala bala voices um i don't know about that if i was a singer i would not be want to be part of bala voices because it, bala voices why the, why are, are they not creating a group from the family which is like going to be an extension of bala brothers because i don't want to be singing in an umbrella whereby the the big thing is someone's surname like it's like me singing for jackson voices and i'm like that's a jackson family and i'm ah uh, why they bala voices should be bala family you know like extension of bala brothers you know ah uh, uh, i'm not i'm not here for that but i like what they're doing god because they're giving the kids exposure in gq i can go my auditions this pink is there zwai is there Pelo is not there and he comes very late. Ulputuzwai asks him one simple question. Why are you late? Which is like, it needs an answer, you know. And I think he would have heard whatever that he was going to say. Ayo Pelo, you know what? You are unfair. Ayo Pelo. 
Gumkulwa wa kolona. Aibo, he's old. Not even old. It's about respect for more, for more than anything, you know. And Upelo just da 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 da. He's like, you know, being late is not gonna change things. I'm like, no, man. I think if Pelo came late and humbled themselves himself and provided a valid explanation, Uzwayu Muntu, he would have understood honestly. I I think there's mental health separate. There's his calling separate but there's also a problem also with him and his just attitude as much as we love him and we want to justify oh no but he's dealing with a lot and lot but guys at the end of the day he must take accountability of his actions i believe the first step is taking accountability i don't know i feel like he's acting like a spoiled bread honestly that's how i feel but um let us wait and see what's going to happen next week um for now there, those are the just few things I wanted to discuss about. I've done another uh, video on Ipala family, but let's see next week what's going to happen. Do certainly share your thoughts in the comment section below and let me enjoy this spectacular view. I love you so much and stay blessed. Salute.